Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia presents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast. On April 24, citizens of Western Armenia will pay tribute to the memory of the victims of genocide of Armenians. A commemoration ceremony for the victims of the genocide of Armenians will be held in French city of Marcel. We must put aside segregation and unite, as we were united in 1988, mayor of Shushi. Relations between Greeks and Armenians are very strong. Constanio Gelukes took part in an event dedicated to the commemoration of the genocide of Armenians. Meeting with Western Armenian deputy Mihran Pergic, a new water supply system is being built in the Artsakh village of Yerzaho. The village will be provided with warm the clock water supply. The Armenian boxers become European champions. An Armenian museum will be opened in Iran, a city of Tabriz. Deputies of the National Assembly of Western Armenia, members of the government, and citizens of Western Armenia will take part in the March of Remembrance, which will be held on April 24th in Tsetevna Kabert. The march starts at 12 a.m. Chairman of the National Council of Western Armenia, Armena Kabraman, Congress of Armenians of Western Armenia, National Association and Supporters of Armenian Veterans, we invite you to attend the memorial ceremony for the victims of the genocide committed against the Armenian people, which will be held in Marseille on April 24th at 11 a.m. Address April 24, 1915, Prospect 13012, Marcel in front of the Mother Hugging Her Sons Monument. The ceremony will be held in accordance with the protocol. According to the mayor of the city of Shushi, of the Republic of Artsakh, Artsvik Sarkisyan, if there is a need for him in Freedom Square, he will come from Artsakh and join those who are there. I'm sure that those in Freedom Square are on the right track. The zombie mass thinks that if Azerbaijani lived in Artsakh, it means that it is Azerbaijani. This thought should be cleared of themselves at going to Freedom Square. They should realize that there is no Armenia without Artsakh, and vice versa. People should think that if today Artsakh citizen was deported from their settlement. Tomorrow or the day after tomorrow they will be deported because the president of Azerbaijan declares that Yerevan is Azerbaijani, Sunik and Sevan are exactly the same. I have said once again that the church of St. Hazan Chetot in Shushi is 50 years old than Azerbaijan. We must unite, put segregation on one side and unite as we were united in 1988, Artsvik Sarkisyan said. Chairman of the Parliament Commission of Greek Parliament on National Defense of Foreign Relations, Konstantinos Koulekas, took part in an event dedicated to the 107th anniversary of the genocide of Armenians in Salonik. He laid a race on a monument of unknown soldier. Regarding the event, he noted, the ties between Greeks and Armenians are numerous and very strong. The two people are also connected by two genocides, the genocide of Armenians and the subsequent Pontic and Western Armenian Greeks. A meeting was held in the Yerevan representation of Western Armenia with the deputy of Western Armenia, the intellectual and owner of the publication Pargic, Mihran Pargic and other deputies. During the meeting, Mihran Pargic presented the book Traces of Our Existence, written by him, in which he describes the history of the return of Dersim Armenians to their own identity. The deputy shared his thoughts on the ideas of Dersim people, as well as assessed the approach of Dersim Armenians to Western Armenia and related programs from a personal point of view. Mihran Pargish noted with great enthusiasm the need for the Armenians to work with certain programs and projects, emphasizing the need for their unity in the common struggle. A new water supply system is being built in the Yerzau community of Shushi. This is stated by the head of community Arta Kakopian. According to him, there are 46 farms in a village with 145 residents who live and create in their homeland with love and devotion. After the war, seven displayed families settled in the village. They are provided with necessary living conditions. People are involved in agriculture work. We have about 15 houses in the free housing stock, which we will provide to the displaced families, Hakopian noted. The main direction of employment of the population of the village these days is the cultivation of melons and gardening. Besides, there are a large number of beekeepers. The village is provided with gas, electricity, and soon round-the-clock water supply. According to the plan, in the near future, intercommunal roads will be asphalted. 
At the European Youth Boxing Championship in Bulgaria, the representative of Armenia, Eric Israelan, became the gold medalist in the final match. Israelan had victory over the representative of Bulgaria, Kirill Barisov. Eric Israelan had five victories at the European Youth Championship, three of which by knockout. Ares Hakopian from the Armenian national team also performed in the final stage, who became the silver medalist. A boxer from Akhalkala, Gorai Vazian, representing Georgia, also became the European European boxing champion, winning the first gold for Georgia. Western Armenia congratulates its children on the victory, wishing them new and great victories. An Armenian museum will be opened in the arena city of Tavris, said the head of the provincial department of the Ministry of Culture, Heritage, Handicrafts and Tourism. Ahmed Hamzayazadeh said this at a meeting with the primate of Armenian diocese of Atarpatakan, Grigor Chivchan, stressing that the preservation of historical Armenian monuments is one of the most important duties of the department. There are many Armenian monuments in the province and the main leadership has taken special measures to restore and preserve them. And after this, events, the opening of the Armenian Museum in Tavriz is one of the agenda. He said, Besides, he added that there are invaluable Armenian monuments in the province, including the Monastery of San Stepanos, which is included in a list of UNESCO World Heritage List. Now musical part, Armenian folk song, Sharakan Ensemble, Yerging Nampele. The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.